Welcome back to Talk of the Town. We are joined by Miss Peg Gibson here, who is the president of the Hilton Head Area Bridge Association. Thank you. Now, bridge is one of those things that's kind of a mystery if you don't know how to play bridge, right? So yep. this is a great organization that can demystify bridge. You can teach people how to play, <laughs> right? You all are right there in Port Royal Plaza. We are. Let me put it in perspective for yeah. those of you that don't know much about our organization. Um, the um, spectrum of bridge clubs in the United States, there are 2,700 what? sanctioned bridge clubs in the United States, of which the Hilton Head Island Bridge Association is number 46. Is that right? Out of 2,700, that's a pretty respectable number. Absolutely. Now, what does it take to be sanctioned? That's a um, It's the American Contract Bridge League. So we run sanctioned games. It means they have a referee. Per, you know, and people earn master points. Yeah. So we run games, uh, 10 games a week, which is a huge amount, Monday through Saturday, uh, sometimes twice a day. And uh, we keep growing. It's thanks to our town folk and visitors who come. We have a huge number of visitors that come from out of town just to vacation here and play and bridge. And play. You want to do I what know. you love when you come to Hilton Head. What a great outlet. We have education programs. We have junior bridge. So we have lots to, to offer people sure. and that's why we keep growing. Absolutely. Let's talk about some of your fall programs. Okay. Well, again, we have our 10 games a week. We have, we're running two education sessions right now. We have uh, a session for newer people each semester. We have something for new bridge players and we have something for experienced bridge players. So our program started in September, it'll end in November. And uh, we just keep putting new bridge players to our programs, they learn. And then we have an experiential uh, area called supervised play, where on Monday nights they can come and they can practice their skills. And then next semester, we'll follow on with two more um, series, one for newer players and one for more experienced players. And so you also have a junior program. Every Saturday, 10 o'clock, is junior bridge time at our club. We have children as young as eight years old wow. that are learning to play bridge. Now, you don't learn bridge in a day, um, but it's never too early to start. I've always wanted never to learn late. how to play bridge. I love cards. I you love have, games. Oh, especially people who have touch and felt cards before. Bridge is not an easy transition. It's a more cerebral, difficult game, but it's learnable by the masses. That's why we have thousands and thousands of people playing yeah. across the United States. And so the tournament coming up, tell oh. us a little bit about the tournament. Do we have a date on that? Yes. November 8th and 10th. Yes, I'll tell you about our um, Low Country Camellia Classic Tournament. This is our 20th anniversary of our Camellia wow. Classic sectional. It happens on November 8th through November 10th, and some of our junior bridge players will be Are playing get in right our in tournament. There. They get right in it there. It is they amazing no what some fear. of these kids can do. Amazing. Absolutely no fear. So um, it's held at the Hilton Head Beach and Tennis Club. Um, we'll expect a couple of hundred people to join us for this tournament, um, and this one is held every year. Tell what is like the object of bridge? What's like to it, win? It, well, of course it is. But I mean, like when you're playing, you know, it's it's uh, Rummy is getting pairs. Well, you know, well, cribbage br is bridge, pegging. Bridge. Anybody who has experienced uh, euchre or pinochle, uh -huh. um, this is uh, or whist, bid whist or plain whist. This is a game that's very, very so like uh, the similar. tricks, it's like getting trick, the, okay. it's a trick. Okay. It's a trick taking game. Yeah. So each person has thirteen cards. Of course, you want to take as many tricks as you possibly can. Sure. It's it has uh, bidding strategy. You have a partner, so it takes the partnership experience to a new level because. Partners have to know how to communicate <laughs> at the bridge table, so that's quite a challenge. 52 yeah. cards, is it, or is yeah, it multiple decks? It's a normal decks? deck, it's a normal, normal deck. De you know, yeah. I have a friend who always had a deck of cards in his pocket, and w no matter where we were or what we were doing, it would just be immediately when he would sit down for our visit, uh -huh. you know, or wherever we were, a restaurant, whatever, no matter how many friends, he would just whip out the deck of cards and we would just quietly just kind of start playing. Well, I have a picture of my six-month-old granddaughter sitting at the table in front of me while I have my cards spread out. So. My child, my grandchildren are going to learn to play cards. It is so important. It is really, it is a wonderful thing to it teach is. kids, especially with the, that tactile. Yes, you know absolutely. the tactile thing. Okay, mm -hmm. so big changes in 2020. Our club is growing. We're so proud, and we're so thankful to the town of Hilton Head for supporting us. Um, next year, we have two huge events that I want to just talk about for a minute. The first is a regional tournament, and that will be held in February at the Marriott Hotel. A regional tournament is a big deal, yeah. um, and this is the fourth largest tournament in the United States. The second thing that we're doing is also huge. We have a guest speaker. His name is Larry Cohen. He's world-renowned, 
and he's coming to our island to hold a seminar. And that's going to happen the first weekend in May. I think it's May 2nd and 3rd at the Country Club of Hilton Head. So This much is going a on. huge accomplishment for us to get yeah. a national speaker here. Um, and anybody who is a student of the game is going to want to come to his seminar. Yes, yes. It's one of those things, learn from the best. Absolutely. Bridge, bridges Yay. in the air. Peg Thank Gibson, you. thanks so much mm -hmm. for being with us. I appreciate it. We'll be right back with more Talk of the Town.